Well, I'm very excited. First burn's going well. It's burning off a bit of moisture in there. You can see a little condensation on the glass, uh, but that's because it's been sitting for a while. So, uh, yeah, first burn's going really well. The system's working good. Uh, I've opened up all my doors in my shop, so I got lots of fresh air. It's actually pretty cold in here. Uh, you can see I have the other pieces in there burning off the galvanize, and um, uh, just so that I can uh, eventually make them this into good stovepipe. This will have to burn uh, from its own, from the heat from this wood stove, or I'm hoping it will. Uh, if not, I have to arrange it outside and make a little fire in my fire pit and just roll these things around in it. But uh, yeah, this, um, wow. And it didn't smoke. Uh, I have all the vents open. Uh, check the, the little Minicube uh, website, uh, Minicube wood stove. And by the way, they're not paying me anything. You can tell I'm using... Um, and, and be careful with the pipe you choose. I have a great home hardware in Wasaga Beach, actually, that um, they sell really good quality stuff. You can buy some of this duct uh, type of um, uh, three inch pipe that is not thick enough to be used. And some of it's even aluminum. So, but again, I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't recommend, I refuse to recommend this. I'm just showing you what I'm doing. Um, you have to go at your own risk, uh, but uh, basically, um, I'm not getting paid by Minicube at all to, to to show this off. I'm just excited because you got to admit this is so cute. So if it actually functions as I hope it will, and it appears to be functioning very nicely, uh, when I have this set up in my houseboat, I'm going to find some pot sizes that actually fit on this. Dee's all worried I'm going to dirty up the the stove, I got news, I'm going to dirty up the stove because <laughs> that's how it rolls. To use something, you got to mess it up a bit. Um, but still, this setup it might be so good that we'll keep it permanently, not just for cold water in, in our, um, uh, cold weather, sorry, in our houseboat. We may keep it in permanently. So, um, so I'm hoping these are smaller pipes. I'll put heat shields on the pipe. I'll, I have uh, basically I used for the houseboat over these years. I used uh, uh, tile flooring mesh and just corrugated it sort of um, and wrapped it around uh, my existing pipe. So I'll do something so that you can't get your hands on. And I may need so you can't touch it and it won't be hot. That that worked well, although it's a little bit rough and 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 sharp. But the bottom line is. That's maybe a good thing because you tend to avoid it. So, uh, yeah, doing good. Here we go. That's it. Sucking air. Listen to that. That's a good sign because you get a cleaner burn if you burn hot. So that's working really good. And I can see some smoke coming, like it's steam. It's You can see it here too, I hope, in the video. It's basically burning off any oils or anything that have been on um, on the stove for shipping. So it's, it's, it's getting hot. That's excellent. All right, do visit RoyDesignThat.com for some bizarre ideas. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care.